Well, Corbin's name had been a prominent one in Pennsylvania politics for some time. He is the Senate president pro tem, but he hadn't been doing all that well in the polls. And this all coming at a time when another state senator, Doug Mastriano, is currently leading the Republican field for governor. So during a news conference earlier today, Corman said that it's time to get behind someone who can win against Democrat Josh Shapiro in November. Some establishment Republicans are worried that Mastriano swings too far to the right and could win the primary but lose a general election. Here's what Corman and Barletta had to say earlier. It's my job uh, to show leadership when it matters. And so um, today, I think putting the, the party first, uh, it's time for me to uh, step aside and support someone who can win in the fall. As we're coming down to the final days, you know, I may not have been somebody's first choice, maybe not their second choice, maybe not even their third choice. But come election day, I, don't, I believe we're all united that we cannot let Josh Shapiro become our next governor. You can see Senator Jake Corman there right here on State Street in Harrisburg shortly after this announcement was made earlier today here in Harrisburg. Now, some political observers have wondered whether Corman's announcement today was too little too late. Corman, of course, has been in the single digits for polling for some time now. It's also worth noting that Doug Mastriano in some polls is ahead by double digits. Two of the other top four candidates, Bill McSwain and Dave White, they've also said they're not getting out of this race. Primary is set for next week, May 17th. In Harrisburg, Tom Lehman, WGAL News 8.